that's what element he is, if he's spiral on fuck, right? Hello and welcome guys, today we are going to look at my Klee. Klee is by far my best character in this game, because unfortunately I just don't have a lot of characters. She's the only character I leveled up to level 90 and she's like one of the two that I leveled that I actually ascended to be even rich, level 90. Um, we have her, my only 5 star weapon on her, which is the Lost Prayer, which is kind of her best weapon that you can have. My stats are pretty damn good with 70, 170, and eh, decent attack. Um, and we have a Wanderer's Trope, because her child attack is fully maxed. So, um, I fully maxed out her charge attack, so everything about this set is supposed to do as much damage with a single charge attack and her kit does support charge attack so that's mainly how i use her most of the time most of the time and uh, we're going for the comps and the support that we're going to have today because we're going to have bennett bennett has the highest base attack weapons that i have which is prototype ankle um so he's going to transfer that attack and he also happens to have and we also have him at level 8 so that's how much attack he's going to transfer to us we also have him with Klee so that means spiral resonance is another 25 attack percent we have a sucrose in our party which is thanks to our passive is going to transfer us a total of a, another extra AD elemental mastery because unfortunately I just don't have that much elemental mastery on her currently speaking we have um, C6, so that means we can take advantage of this, meaning that when we use her Q, we get another 20% elemental damage to element that it absorbed, um, which is fine. And we also have Flint Tails, which will give us 48 attack bonus. And we're looking at a VV set, meaning that 40% less pyro resistance to the opponent. We also have a Rosaria, which is purely support to uh, apply cryo to um, activate melt and that's the reason why we have so much elemental mastery and we are running a lot of crit rate so we'll be transferring about 13 12 percent crit rate so that will make our clean much more consistent um yeah so that the first team will be running to kind of be the base for all of our testing because what we're going to try after that is we're going to try with attack sense fortunately today somehow magically I got a very decent attack sense of the Wanderer's Trope. After years of not getting any decent attack one, I have this and I have this. Uh, yeah, my Diluc has that one and we'll talk about that later because after that we're going to take my Diluc artifact, which is a Lava Walker, which are very decent because these are his stats. We're looking at about the same stats um, that my Klee artifacts give me. About the same. Um, a bit more crit rate, a bit less crit damage. So yeah, it's about the same artifact, so what we're going to run then is a mono pyro team to see how faster can a mono pyro team that also take advantage of Klee's Q and D e will do, because when we're doing charge attack, when we're doing melt charge attack, we're not necessarily going to take advantage of Klee's entire kit, but since it is leveled up and it is good, we might as well try it out with a mono pyro team, and in that mono pyro team, We'll have a Shengling, cause Shengling I do have C1, which also decreases Pyro res. But yeah, let's start. So first of all, we'll start with the Elemental Mastery Klee and see how fast she can do. So what we're looking to do is this. Is this. This and this. If this can apply Pyro. Yep. We're looking at... Whoa, how much was that? Okay, let's transfer to our attack sense and look at the stats there. Okay, so here is our stats with the attack sense. Our elemental mastery is very low, so we'll see if that makes a difference. No okay, crit, 68. Hmm, we're only using charge attack, so I might as well use charge attack only for the other one as well, right? Boom. Boom. 
What are my stats now? Wait, those are my normal stats anyway. And this is our stats with the level walker set. So yeah, a bit more crit rate, a lot more crit rate actually. A bit less um, crit damage. And one, and a two, and a three. This is surprisingly slower. Technically, I could probably do more DPS. I guess that means we need to kill the pile frog. I don't want to get out, kill the frog, goddammit. Bets what element he is if he's pile on fact, right? What? <laughs> uh, you know what? Fine, let's showcase it. I don't care. What is it like? 50, 40 percent resistance? Eh, I will shred that easy. Now I can do this. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, and now I can do this. If you look at the stats, well, we don't have that much attack yet. Really? Benny's ult already ran out? Fuck me. We're very close to one cycle, man. Hey, I did something, I think. Well, it wasn't a one cycle, but considering he was Pyro, that was very close. I mean, it was like 70% of his health gone, right? Something like that. So that's pretty cool. I don't have much more to say about it, except uh, I love playing Kli. She's very fun. She's very cute. Kli being unique. Very cool. With that, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you next time. Till then, bye.